guys, Nary here from Drake Wing Gaming. Something new me on Twitter, the Gaming Dragon. Today I'm coming back at you another Let's Play episode of Dragon Island. So I thought that there was like oh, maybe just like not even like a video's worth of content left. You guys are telling me that there's something really cool that happens at the end. So okay, I, I guess I'm gonna just uh, go through this with you guys and see what we get. Hopefully it'll be a decent length episode. But anyway, guys, please sit back and enjoy for the next 18 minutes. We'll entertain you. Let's jump right in. Alarm saying you're up and let's go. My voice sounds a little different because I'm sick, so it might either be deeper or scratchier. I apologize. <clears throat> I merely want to play a little game with you sinners. This, this isn't one of those killing games, is it? Gay, rot games, games. <laughs> I think I did that pretty well. Oh, Chang, he did the. Uh, okay, my accent for him. <clears throat> if I can do it right now. Holy shit. Mm. I got mm, mm. Polly, shut up. Ah, didn't do it. What? Killing? Why would you assume... Oh, my appearance. Right. D, no, no, killing. But this game does have delightful punishments depending on how you perform. No offense, but if this has nothing to do with painting, I'm out. I'll just wait for the boat to... How adorable. You thought the boat was on its way. What? I've recalled the rescue ship. If you want to leave this island, you'll have to play. Leong, I thought you made the call. I did. Hmm. The slightest issue and you start becoming paranoid. Listen here, you, listen here. You can't imprison us on this island or keep us from leaving. Let's go, let's go immediately, or... Or what? You'll take me to court, Mr. Grace Attorney. Shang Wei growled as his whiskers twitched and fists clenched. He looked ready to punch something. Leong reached over and grabbed him by the shoulder, though Chang shrugged his hand away. I think you understand your situation now, right? There's no rescue, no escape until I'm satisfied. If you want to leave, just be good little dragons and listen. The picture on the wall switched to a slideshow. It seemed that this guy had a presentation. Fuck that! Um, with an angry roar, Motsei smashed the projector and plunged the room into darkness. Oh god, really? One second, guys. Uh, I guess the presentation wasn't fresh enough for you. Oh, you want a piece of me too? Everyone fell into a nervous silence. Dim moonlight shone through the floor-to-ceiling windows, faintly illuminating our faces. Nobody wanted to make the first move, like a group of children not wanting to be the first to answer a teacher's question. There were no words spoken, just the sound of breathing and anxious swallowed saliva. Anxiously swallowed. We glanced at each other, eyes meeting and then, and then passing each other's other e and then passing over each other's faces in quick glances. Black, glowing red eyes did not move, and were stuck gazing up at the ceiling. Why did the host invite all of us here? We are all strangers, and it wasn't like our paths had ever crossed before. Why did the boat get wrecked? Why was this island resort empty? Most importantly, was this demon dragon really our host? If so, why disguise himself behind a mascot character? In this game he talked about. Whatever he had in mind, I couldn't help but feel like I was in over my depth. Ding, 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 ding. Damn it, I can't go back. The silence was broken as our phones began to chime, buzz and ring incessantly. We've got cell signal? With trembling hands, I unzipped my pack and pulled out my phone as it vibrated and hummed. Normally, I would have let the call go to voicemail, but now? Nope. Instead of the phone call screen, however, I was greeted by a familiar dragon mascot peering at me. Did you really think you could stop me, stop me by merely breaking the projector? His true face may have been obscured, but I was almost certain he was laughing at us. It's almost adorable, really. What? What is this? Some kind of computer virus? Damn it! How are you doing this? When it was just a projector, I could have just said this whole thing was a prank. But now, I couldn't be so sure. A billionaire, a billionaire largesse could explain the yacht in the private island resort. But if he could control our phones, then his influence was far greater than I expected. Suddenly, a projector lit up as ominous music began to play. The demon dragon's voice seemed to pour in from all directions. Now listen up. I'm only going to say this once. The reason I invited the seven of you to this island is because you all share the same trait. All of you have profiles on the WooHoo dating app. When you make your profile, you must choose between bottom, top, and switch, which is pretty self-explanatory. You all picked top, but... Only one of you is a true top. Oh my god. 
The demon dragon fell silent. I would have thought his microphone was turned off if it weren't for the slight rustling noise of speakers. Is there some kind of gap in the script? Is he just pausing before saying, and that the top is the murderer or something? And that's why you brought us to this island. That's it. Yes, now let's move on to the next... Hold on, you went to all this trouble to gather us here because someone lied on a dating app? Oh, come on, you can't actually be serious. What the hell are you trying to pull? It is a bit silly. More than a little. It feels like a half-baked plot device in a poorly made video game. I wouldn't say this is poorly made. Silence! I covered my ears as the speakers boomed. Such disgusting indifference. You sinners all deceived so many people, and yet you refused to repent. Moving on, here are the rules for the game. Listen up if you still want to go back. 1. You have three days to find the true top among yourselves. 2. Each night you will all vote anonymously on who the true top is. But only the final vote on the third night will count. 3. If you fail to play along or run out of time, I'll cut off the island's electricity and water supply, and of course your cell signal. 4. If you all guess correctly, and you'll be allowed to leave, but everyone will pay a small price. A notification popped up on my screen with a chime. I glanced at the others as they read their own screens. I nervously glanced at the others before tapping the notification and reading the message. The others at least have something I can threaten them with, but you have no status, career, or savings, so you have little to lose. But I can still buy your apartment complex from your landlord and get you evicted. Well, that's just rude. Have you all finished reading? Good, because I'm moving on. Five. If you all choose wrong, then whoever is mistaken for the top will have to be will leave punished. Think of it as a demon's prize for the greatest sinner. <laughs> I've, always, I've always wanted to see if the Lord of the Flies was real or just an exaggeration of the author's fancy. So by all means, struggle, squabble, stay on the island, and satisfy my curiosity. Nobody wants that! The first vote is in a mere 30 minutes. Now please, now please me with your lies, betrayals, and deceit. Let the game of Dragon Island begin. Oh, wow, okay. Alright then. I guess that was the end? Oh, that's cute. Thanks for playing. Okay. Well, that turned... That was a, okay, it wasn't a full-length episode, but, you know. Uh, it was about, like I said, eight, nine minutes, maybe? Thanks for playing. Okay. Oh, man. Alright, so... My thoughts so far, I am very much intrigued by this. Um, I, yeah, I, I really like the idea of this. I like some kind of crazy, crazy jigsaw-like game, I suppose. I don't know. Good lord, I'm trying to get that bulge off the screen so it doesn't get me demonetized. There we go. Okay. Alrighty. Let's, uh... There we go. Okay. So, okay. <clears throat> Alright. So, all right. So, I, I really like the uh, sprite work and everything. I think the sound is the sound design is really nice. I like I like the music. Um, I can't wait to see what uh, what happens in the story. I mean, this is really silly. This is like a very very gay version of Saw, I guess, without the torture. I don't know. There might be torture. Who knows? We haven't really gotten into it. Um, the uh, demon dragon character seems to be uh, seems to not be averse to cruelty in varying degrees so you know you never know what he's capable of he might he might kill somebody or might just hurt them real bad you never know but yeah so i'm very much looking forward to this guys uh just let me know in the comments when it's out and i will definitely give it a try but anyway guys thank you so much for watching don't forget to like comment subscribe ring that notification bell leave a super thanks or a tip if you can it always helps until the next video i love you all i'll see you next time Bye bye